Hi guys, I just got a question. What's the difference between all of these projects? Maybe it makes sense to make a news video about all these ISOs that we have, right? If you type Arconex, then it's just a name, but there is so much more than uh, the websites that we have. So an overview of, uh, not the websites, but of the ISOs. Starting from the ISOs, we have the Arconex project. So you can download Arconex ISOs. These guys are Arch based, 90% is pure Arch, 5% is coming from us and 5% is coming from the AOR, which is Arch user repository. We build packages, so you can just pseudo pacma minus S them. Simple, right? XL and D and all that, those guys, Arconex project provides a graphical interface. You boot up and you get Calamars. That's important to know. Okay, next thing, Arclix ISO is the what if. What if we explain to you guys how we created Arclix? And we explain that in Cardi, customized Arclix ISO. We built, we tell you from A till Z, from three, four years ago, we started making videos and we've had Plasma, XFCE, and now we have Cinnamon. And it's simple, right? Well, once you get everything uh, done right, then it's simple. <laughs> everything is set up and you understand everything was going on, then it becomes simple. So it's with knowledge. Knowledge is here. We give you the knowledge. So Carly is an ISO. The result is an ISO that again provides a graphical interface with Calamari. So very similar to right, Arclix. But this is how to build one from scratch. The other project that we had is ALCI. On, well, that we have is ALCI online. This pitch, this this view, this what if is what if we don't rise the system we give you, the ISOs we give you, but keep it very pure arch, but with a graphical installer because hey, typing everything in, that's not fun, right? So we keep putting into something graphical, we give a very, very simple Calamaris and then all the rest is up to you. The Calamaris in Arconex has an advanced one and is quite complex. This one isn't. Back to the basics like Ubuntu or anything else. Who are you? How do you want to format things? Go. Very few selections and you have a system that works. That's the Arch Linux Calamaris installer. So pure Arch, Calamaris, mix them together, go. The last thing that we have is the riser.eu is where we say we can build at any point in time a new archlinks.org ISO. But what if we com combine it with the project of Pico and give you an Alice folder which will install anything you like? All right, it's a flexible, variable kind of way, but it's not with Calamaris. It is pure black screen TTY thing, and you run a script which is super untechnical, like few things you need to know. Bam, you've got XFC. I've just made a promotion video for it. So that's the overview. Somebody asked, give me an overview. That's pretty much the overview. And we've done, we've given you some kind of overview if you go to the information website here as well so if you think oh my god all these urls here they are we offer many ways to install arch Linux based operating system there are 33 iso with the arconix with calamaris there's one iso for carly which changed over time plasma xfc now it's cinnamon with calamaris there is an oriser project and that's without calamaris that's a script from pico there's the ALCI project where we've um, Y7, eh? Linux kernel, Linux LTS kernel, Linux Xenmod kernel, Linux Zen kernel, with Mate, with Plasma, with XFC, with Cinnamon. We switched around things, but always with Calamars. And we also teach you to go for a pure Arch Linux install without Calamars, or with the Arch install, that's a script that's now provided not only I've not not five years or so ago, but a year or two maybe ago, maybe just a year ago, 
that it was allowed not to start typing everything in, but using a script and you make decisions inside the script. But this is interactive. And the Arisu project, so the Alice scripts, are not interactive. You set it up, it's a variable, you choose XFCE, push it to the GitHub, it's XFCE. There's no interaction inside these scripts and that's what I like about it because this one gives us an unattended installation. Unattended, automated, reconfigured, set it up once and run it a trillion of times. All right. So I hope that gives you an overview um, about uh, the, the ISOs and, and the, the things that we provide. And again, here in the beginning of the articlelinks.info website, here is more or less all the links you need for our projects and the downloads. Cheers.